Hello doctor, my name is Sergio Garcia and today I will talking about in the segment number 5 the bending of rectangular simple support planes for exercise number 2. Well, the exercise number 2 consists in for an application on the hook clock. When the hook clock states that the normal stress is directly, directly proportional to the strength and the jump modulus is in a proportional constant. In that case, we have seen the hook slope determinant for the normal stress is equal for the jump modulus plus the deformation. And you can see we have on the plane that that part is in a clampet and that part. Another thing is that when you consider that the issues act y equals 0 and b equal and a low will have an a uniform and uniform strength and you can see the normal stress in that part is having a different a different direction for the x-axis and you can see that it's negative Well, for you continue for the hook slope, we determine that the most the most metal allows an uh, turn some polymers and consider it to be an isotropic. Where by definition, the materials proposed are independent di uh, direction, and they have two elastic con uh, constant are usual spread for the jump modulus e and the position radio. In that case, we have the jump modulus and the position radio. We have a matrix when you consider and this is equation for x, y, and c. Another thing is for the the strength for y is equal to zero, and x and c is different for zero. Considering that part, we have the, the this expression. That is an expression we can have to consider when a, when you consider for the another thing. Well, I can see the way this is for the displacement are small and for the for the strain and we have and this part and this parameter for for b w and u we have an uh, an introduction we have this expression and this expression for the component of displacement u v and w 